All right, guys, here's the scoop. Have you ever been inside a bathroom and you saw somebody's phone number written on the walls and you went, hey, what the fuck is the deal with that? That's what I'm gonna find out today. We're gonna call these people up and get to the bottom of this. First, I have to hit up some local bathrooms to find the numbers. Pretty average dive bar bathroom in here. Look, what is this, new series? Why, why do they have an advertisement for a TV show in here? It's like, oh yeah, bro, you heard about that new show, All Rise? I just found out about it the other day while I was taking a shit. Lots of writing on the roof. I don't see any phone numbers here though. Cleanse my soul and quench my thirst for love. Go back to sociology class. Go right in your diary, fucking emo. Thanks for the reminder. Ned with a heart. You think this person is still in love with Ned? I have my doubts. I want to skull fuck you until it's love. Who writes this, bro? Let's try a different bathroom. Pushing one out in there, Becca. Found the phone number. Right there. Man, there was somebody who sounded like they were pooping their guts out in there. And then he came out and it was this super classy looking Asian dude. It was wild. All right, guys, I found the first number. It was written on the bathroom wall and it said to call for anal. Let's call this first number. The number you have reached is not in service. Too many people wanted anal. Okay, this bathroom is really neat. There's definitely no phone numbers in here. I still have to wait it out because I'll look like a psycho if I just walk in and out of the bathroom. Like, did you just pee in five seconds? Maybe I'll poo. Maybe I'll take a poo. It's a bathroom. Oh, you guys watch Uncut Gems yet? Oh. This is what I'm doing at 24 years old. All right, guys, I found a bunch of other numbers. Let's call these people up. Your call has been forwarded to a voicemail service. Well, at least it rang. I guess that's progress. Next number. The customer you are calling is unavailable at the moment. Wow. Please try again later. <sighs> okay, next one. Hello? Hey, uh, I found your number on the wall. Hello? Who is this? I think you got the wrong number. You, didn't, you never wrote your number on the wall? No. Okay, sorry. Okay, I mean, listen, it's progress. People are answering. Maybe that was somebody's old number or they wrote it as a prank on someone. Next number. The cellular number you have called is not assigned. Ah! Thank you for calling a real estate group. Your call is important to us. We are <laughs> it's a real estate group. Your guy's number is on a wall. Next number. Hey there, we sent your call to our voice message system. It's available right now. When you hear the beep, record your message. Why'd you ignore my call, Becca? Okay, this next number said to call it for a good time. Uh? Hey, what's up, dude? Uh, I found your number on the wall. Oh! <laughs> so that one was, was clearly somebody put that dude's number there as a prank. Should I call back? I think he was angry with me. Okay, this guy is gonna yell at me if I call back, I think, but I'm gonna call back. You have reached the voice mailbox of... Hey, I just said to call for a good time, dude. I don't know if that's like Scrabble or... Next number. You have reached the number that is not equipped for incoming service. Please check the number. Not equipped for incoming service. What do you have, one of those 1972 phones? Next number. Hello? Hello? Hey, dude. Uh, I found your number on the wall in... <laughs> What's up, dude? Um, just chilling. Just got home. What about you? Uh, just chilling, dude. I'm making like a video about calling random phone numbers from like restaurants or like bathroom stalls. Oh, uh, that's so funny. Yeah, it's it's funny because um, I knew my number's been on for a while, but I'm surprised it's still there. Yeah, it's still there, dude. So what was the what was like the motivation for writing it? No, I, I did not write it myself. I think like some I think like either like one of my friends or someone wrote it on there. I'm I'm actually not sure to this day who wrote my number. How many phone calls do you get from that? Um I think like last year I got like a couple, but then it stopped, so yeah. 
<laughs> so I guess you're the first one of this year. Damn. This is weird, but would you potentially be down to meet up? All right, where is this fella? It's you? What's up, bro? How's it going? Nice Keep to meet on. you. Keep on? Keep on, yeah. Keep on. Yeah. Dope to meet you, bro. How's it going? Thanks for doing this. Yeah, of course. I know it's hella random. You ever watch Inception? Yeah. That's like one of my top five movies. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. Yo, Leo DiCaprio. DiCaprio, bro. Bro, DiCaprio, I think, is the best actor of our generation. Man, he's a legend. I don't think anyone else measures up. He's honestly a legend. Do you have a message you want to send to the all the people at home? Maybe just, you know, stay strong. What el What other movies do you like? There was this um, recent movie called Parasite. I broke into that car you hear it honking. Yeah. <laughs> I broke in with a crowbar. We better get going, then. Yeah. <laughs> I actually really like that guy. Me and him and our girlfriends are going on a double date soon but yeah there you have it i guess all those phone numbers are up there as pranks i know one thing that wasn't a prank today making a friend all right love you guys peace